Hello family, friends, and weird YouTube people who just stopped out my channel because I looked interesting, possibly, or this was an interesting title. Who knows? I haven't created it yet. Hi! I'm back from my cave, as I've said before, but this time I hopefully mean it because I got an email from YouTube, or Google, rather, saying, like, I had to fill out some stuff. I don't know why I'm doing this, like a little puppy dog. Oh. <laughs> um, filling out some stuff for AdSense, which is where Google puts ads on a, your YouTube channel so people can click it and the ads get recognition and the companies get paid. And in turn for having um, ads on your page, you get a little portion. So hopefully I'll be able to start getting a little income here and there instead of just going to school and <sighs> drowning my brain in all of my studies like I I don't even know <laughs> where to begin I've been in a cave because of my classes physics calculus chemistry and a writing class I think I've said all of this before but it takes a toll on you there's a lot a lot of studying, a lot of work that I have to do. And on top of that, I have the Eco Discount Store blog and Facebook that I maintain every single day, writing a little something so we don't lose likes or subscribers or all of that business. But I think this routine is a lot better than where I was a year ago because a year ago, I don't know, I wasn't taking Tuesday, Thursday classes. I went one day, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And... It's just insane, my schedule. I was so lazy. I wasn't really focused on classes because I had just moved here and I was still experiencing the crazy California college life. Well, I'm over that now. <laughs> I don't really care about the party and I save it for the weekend where, sorry to break it to you, mom and dad and grandma and all of them, but last year I was partying a few nights a week because that's what everybody does here. <laughs> I still get good grades and everything, but this semester I am determined to get A's and hopefully it works out. But physics, I don't I don't like physics. Physics is way worse than chemistry. I'm saying that now, and that's saying a lot. I told this to my friend the other day. I hate physics more than I hate chem. And if you were with me my first year, my first semester, chemistry kicked me in the fatouche. <laughs> So, that's where I've been. Oh, and amazing news. Yesterday, well, I've been looking at the schedule for spring semester. And because you have to take classes in sequences, like you can't take Chem 201 before you take Chem 200. And you can't take Bio 203 until you take Chem 200. So, it's just a lot of headaches, which I brought to my advisor and she was like, ah. Oh, this drives me nuts. So, with that said, I decided to declare a minor in oceanography. I'm so excited. Yesterday, I turned in the papers and got approval, and now I have it on my um, degree evaluation, so I know which classes I have to take. It's so exciting. I'm very excited. I've taken two oceanography classes before, and I've loved it, and it goes hand-in-hand -hand with my degree. And it's going to help me out in the long run, like being out on the ocean, knowing, oh no, there's a rogue wave coming, or whatever, you know, <laughs> crazy stuff like that. And I don't know, I just find it really interesting because nobody thinks about this unless they've been told it before, but the moon alignment and the sun alignment all affects waves, like highs and lows and all of that crazy business. So, very excited. I can't wait. Um, it's almost noon here. I have class at 1, so I better be off. But I just wanted to give you guys a little short update on everything crazy going on in my life. Um, yeah, I have a roommate, and I love her. She's awesome. I can't remember, like, the last thing that I've talked about in these videos. I think it was about the Bahamas. The school had just started, maybe. Possibly. Um, I had a huge Halloween, not a huge Halloween party, but a Halloween party, and I had crazy decorations that I don't think I filmed at all. Maybe I got some in some pictures, 
or something. But it's all over, and now I have um, a little bit of Thanksgiving decorations here and there. Not too many. Christmas is going to be crazy decorated. I have all of them in this box that you're sitting on top of. I hope just. I'm so excited. And I'll be home for Thanksgiving, in case you guys didn't know. I think a lot of you will be in Trilingua for a little camping trip. But I will be with my mama and my sister and my immediate family. So I'm very excited about that. Haley's fourth birthday is coming up, and we're having a cute little princess party. So I'm going to be, take a guess, who am I going to be? Little Mermaid, Ariel. Um, and then I'll be back in Texas for not Christmas. I'll be there for New Year's. I'm going to my dad's for Christmas. So lots of trips coming up, lots of uh, video opportunities. So hopefully I'll take them. I really, I tried doing daily vlogs, which obviously hasn't worked out. <laughs> I really want to try getting at least a video up every two weeks, or if not every week. So we'll see how that goes. <clears throat> I have lots to talk about, actually. Like, I don't even want to get into it. Let's just say I'm never dating a California boy because they're scum. Sorry, not sorry to offend any California guys out there. You're scum if you're born here. I haven't met a nice one yet. Who knows, maybe. But right now I'm focusing on school. I'm not in a rush for anything. I'm not going to graduate until 2014, I think, because of all of the classes I have to take here. I'm considered a senior, which is insane to think that I'm going to be a super, super senior or super, 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 whatever. But in the end, it's all going to be worth it. And I'll have my major and a minor. So I'm excited. Okay. Well, I hope everyone has had a wonderful few months since I haven't been able to talk to you. Happy birthday to all of those birthdays that I missed. Happy anniversary. Um, Veterans Day is Friday, so I just want to show all of my support and encouragement to uh, our troops, our veterans, and those families who have lost a family member or who have families overseas. So thank you guys for fighting for us and standing up for our rights. Love you guys. Hope you have a wonderful week. See ya soon.